Oh, and then there you go. Just a little high five, huh? It's okay, we can be friends. Come on up. Just crawl right up on my shoulder. A miss. This is a female. She's gray form, but she's got some pinks to oranges to browns in her. Almost looks like a face there on the abdomen. You can see her depositing little bits of silk. It's her drag line in case she were to fall. Males tend to be black, although there are some aberrant forms other colorations. Females range from black to gray to orange, maybe even red, and variations therein. Males will usually have the green chelicery, those mouth parts. Females can be green or even sort of a pink to purplish color. That magnification, it's a little bit difficult to keep track of this spider. They're very gentle animals. I've held many different Phytopus spiders in this genus, and I've seen hundreds and hundreds of specimens of the regal jumper and handled many of them never been bitten. I've never had any fear of being bitten. Take it up here now. Off of the table. Maybe less likely to jump in that case. They're very gentle spiders. Very smart spiders. Very perceptive spiders. A lot of photographers, of course spend lots of time with them because they are so photogenic. This is a technique that I use to pick jumping spiders up. Basically, I circle my hand around and then just very slowly close. Generally, the spider will itself, before it is completely closed, begin to climb up on at least one of my fingers, if not right out into the opening. That's a more typical way of picking it up there. Feeding time for my beautiful Deep red Phytopus regius. Such responsive spiders. They see everything around them. And so photogenic. And there's a little treat for you guys. Lightening the load. Prepared for a quick escape because it does sense my presence. The vibrations in my voice even. My exhale. And this light. And so it's prey subdued. It's looking for a spot now where it can finish its meal in peace. And so we'll give it that. One more quick look at its beautiful coloration. And then also maybe 
an extreme close-up. 